the trident sigil. All There's right. Silver I can use. Get some Poseidon. Oh, oh, we can start collecting this too. I will say, oh, I gotta actually like collect it. Mm, not, not so hot on that, but you know, I kind of hope it was just like one button. Like even just to attack it, maybe that would have been nice. I do want to say before I talk to Poseidon here, this is like several days later. This is quite a few days, like almost like a week later from the previous episode. Um, and I'm sick. I got a head cold. It really sucks. So you're just gonna just, just ignore the snotty nose kind of uh, sound. You're one of my father's brothers, aren't you? Then help him. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. <laughs> Lost niece, you live. We thought you met the same fate as your father and your mother and your brother. Oh. Well, how about we turn the tide and exact terrible revenge for poor old Hades and his kin? Interesting. How about we turn the tide and exact terrible revenge for poor old Hades and his kin? What happened to them? I'm so interested. Special hits foes with a splash that knocks other foes away. Sprint deals damage. I'm not. I don't know sure about the sprint sprint thing. Um, I can. I can actually see. So, I've. Yeah, I could see. Uh, so I read their update that they're gonna be doing certain things with the the next like patch, um, the first like big patch. But I could definitely see the sprint thing maybe going away later because I don't. At least at the time of recording this, I don't feel like there's a use for it really, or I haven't found a use for it because I just am playing it like I do the normal Hades. I've just not gotten used to it. Uh, after you strike foes with your weapon, a spirit bubble may appear, which restores 20 mana. When you touch it, expires when used after 30 seconds. Interesting. Um, let's try the, let's try the, the knockback. We all our enemies drown. Uh, well, you know what? I'm gonna be honest. There we go. Okay, so I can, I can see that being pretty good. I like it. What's this? Oh, give me my mana back. It's kind of, it's kind of nice. It's like, hey, by the way, in case you didn't know. Near all of the near endless pathways and suffocating Erebus lead to dead ends. And very scarce are those who can navigate them. Took only my entire life to figure out. Yeah. But, but yeah, it's like, uh, they, they put that there just in case. Cause you're like, hey, I've got some new ability that I'm gonna try out. Hey, it'll restore your mana, so that way you don't have to worry about it. It's kind of nice. I really like this special. Oh my goodness, I hate these guys though, I'll tell you what. Terrain kill. Oh, I got a fish there. I just saw it pop up. Man, I really like the way that that special feels. It's, man, I don't know. Super giant is just the best at this. Max magic. That's nice. Like they are seriously the best at combat feel. And I love it. Like they know the, it's it's oh, it's really hard to explain, but it's everything from that slowdown moment to it not um like it not just firing and it gives you a second to to figure out like do you want to let go or not or when do you want to let go? to the way the animation plays, to the speed of the animation. Like it, it is a, it is a fine science when it comes to combat feel. And that it, it's, it's a really hard quantitative thing to not only explain, but also like learn how to do. And these, you know, they, they're obviously masters at it at this point. Like when it comes to Bastion back in the day, like, most of the weapons kind of nailed it, but if if you go back back and play Bastion now, then you're like you're playing Hades too. You can see that they have gotten a lot better at their craft, which is great. That's what you want to see, right? Can I go this way? No, it's just another entrance to this area. That's interesting. Um, I don't know what I want out of these two different resources. Let's um, let's get let's get this and see how this goes. Oh, we got a big boy. I just like blast them. Just use up all my mana. Just blast them. Just get rid of one of them. I kind of like that actually. It, it puts me in a position where, um, you know, we're really only having to deal with one of them. Although now, now that I say that, I'm about to have to do some big old dodgy dodges. 
so I don't die to this guy. Does this one have a, a yellow health? No. Okay. I'll take it. Oh, health or money? Health or money? Let's go with some health. I'm curious how far I can get in this run. I also should be looking at the scenery a little bit better. It's something I'm not doing great at, I'll be honest. Man, that's so much fun to do. <laughs> it's very satisfying, like I said. Just everything that comes along with that animation. It's fun to use. It reminds me a lot of the bow in Hades and the bow in, um, in Bastion. It was the same thing, like the, the charge up. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna go do this. Oh, but there's Aphrodite there. I didn't realize Aphrodite was in this one. Come sit and rest your wings. What? You've grown so tired. Fl oh. Hello. What are you doing here? Besides tramping all over my webs, that is. Oh, it's nothing silly. I can always make more perfectly good silk. I can't always see you. This is creepy and awesome. <laughs> Because I hate spiders, but spiders can be cute sometimes, you know? Um, hi, Arachne. Sorry about all this. I think we'll soon be seeing more of one another now. My task has begun. Truly. Why, then, I'll get out of your hair. You have to go. But first, you have to try on one of these. And don't worry about any wear and tear. I've plenty more in stock. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness. Uh, lavender dress. Gain 30 armor? Interesting. A special look and bonus that lasts until your armor is depleted in, uh, from taking damage. Uh, but makes you channel 40% faster. Press and hold attack, special, or cast for powerful magic effect. Uh, emerald dress gives 50 armor. And that makes you restore two health whenever you exit a location. But of course, when it's gone, it's gone. It's interesting. Azure dress. Make sure restore five mana every one second. Let's let's try the um I don't know, I kinda I don't want this to go away, you know. Let's try it. I'm curious how, how good that's gonna end up being. Why this is beautiful, thank you. All in an evening's work. Now is Arachne, um it sounds like the same woman who did uh Dusa. Dusa's voice. I think I think that actually might be the case too. No spiderlings in sight. Interesting. Um, I see the silver over here, so let's definitely get that. I want as much silver as I can get. Oh, you got something. I did. Thank you very much. And a, a plant. I got a plant. I don't have enough money to go to the shop, so I'm not even gonna bother. Tool requ required to compel. To your success. This is cool. I am enjoying this so much. This whole experience is tight. Like, Next. there's something about it, you know, where it kind of doesn't feel like early access. If Supergiant had just like shadow dropped this and we're like, here's Hades 2, would I know? No, no, not at all. The only thing that would have given it away, let's be completely honest, is that placeholder, um, what you might call it, heart asset for, or sprite for one of the gods. I'm not sure which one it is, uh, but it was in the last episode. As expected. Was it the last episode? The episode before that? Crap, now I don't remember. It was one of those, right? There was definitely, it, just like in the first Hades during early access, not all of the gods' art was done. Like, I believe, oh, what was her name? Athena, I believe Athena was not done when, when Early Access first launched, and it was just like a hooded figure, which looked cool. Was it Athena? No, what was the... Is Goddess of the Hunt Athena? That sounds right. That also doesn't sound right. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. One of them, one of them was hooded, just like this uh, placeholder asset, so... That would be my only indication that like, oh, okay, they, they obviously are gonna keep up in this and add more, just like they did in the original early access release. But, but yeah, it's, there's, there is a part of it that's like, it's, this just feels polished in like the final game already. Do bide your time, sunshine. The Titan thinks he has us pinned, but we have the situation here under control. Just locked in a bit of a stalemate is all. 
All right, uh, Nova Flourish. Oh, what's this? It swaps? Sacrifice this boon uh, has improved rarity, but requires you to give up a Wave Flourish. Specials do more damage in a larger area. Hmm. While standing in your cast, gradually restore mana. Or your casts expand in size until they expire. Ooh. That's kind of cool. Uh, let's try Nova Flourish. Let's let's upgrade it. I think that that would be better. And let's go get these ashes. Like, obviously I know the game is not done yet, right? That, that, I think that goes without saying. But there is a part of it that it, it feels super polished already. Like they've they've obviously perfected that part of their their game design process, and maybe just maybe a lot of that has to do with this being a sequel, which is their first sequel, right? So they they don't have to go back to square one in many aspects of game design. You know, they're not jumping from Bastion to Transistor, which are similar games, right? As for my Arcana, but they're different. They're very different at the same time. So there was a lot of, uh, you know, design work that needed to be done between those two experiences. And even though they took some of their learnings from Bastion into Transistor, it's very clear that it's, you know, it's a different kind of experience. So you gotta, you gotta treat it like two different games. And that's what they did in a, in a pretty awesome way, I would say, because like, you have all the lessons learned from Bastion there, but then they like expand upon it, make it a little different, make it a little better. And I really appreciate that. For this, they have the benefit of it being a sequel, so they know their formula already. They know what they can change and make different and add. Ooh, I want to see uh, Aphrodite. And I love that. I just, yeah, it's, there's something about it that just gets me so excited to play this game. Where I'm like, I cannot believe I, I get to play a sequel to one of the greatest games ever made. And I'll tell you what. Oh my goodness, I'll tell you what. In a situation, so this is going to date the video a bit, but Xbox just closed uh, Tango and Arcane uh, Austin. And I believe there was one more studio. Which is just ridiculous because those studios make awesome games. Like uh, Tango made Hi-Fi Rush. The heart sigil. And the reason Microsoft closes them is because, you know, it's affecting their bottom line. Which is so stupid because those games are freaking amazing and those studios are super talented and can make more money for the company if they just kept them around. But obviously I'm not a... I'm not an executive, I don't know that. Um, I don't know why those decisions were made exactly. But then you look at games and studios like Supergiant making Hades and Transistor and Bastion and Pyre and all these crazy awesome games and they're still around and they're still innovating and they're just like one of the best studios. This one knows hatred, not just love. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. <laughs> Why, hello, gorgeous. You look like you can break some hearts even without my aid. Oh, your brother would be so proud knowing you're fighting for your kin. Now that is a different sprite. <laughs> it's a little more, uh, I mean, the previous one was, this is a little bit, <laughs> you know, um, attacks do more damage to nearby foes. Oh, interesting. Uh, cast drags foes in and flicks weak. Ooh. That's interesting. So it kind of sucks, sucks duders in. Actually, that's a pretty good thing because we can use that and then do our special. I kind of like that. Let's try that. I have much to learn from her, I think. Oh, I love that's a heart. Anyways, yeah, like, like Supergiant is over here doing the thing. They are making art. You know, video games are really? art and they don't have executive uh people like at the top trying to make crazy business decisions that are affecting the art side of things you know when you marry art and money together it doesn't work those are not compatible ideas um which is why it's so hard to, to justify like certain costs of art or stuff like that so i find it fascinating just to, to say the least um i'm not buying it. Yes. Okay. 
It's fortunate the underworld boatman's still plying his trade even during a downturn such as this. I trust his prices have gotten better at least. Or perhaps worse. Uh, attacks do more damage in a larger area. Attacks uh, have a chance to hit two times. That's sad, there's only 5%. That'd be way nicer if it was like 10 or 15. Uh, after you take damage, your foe takes damage and you inflict days. Let's go with the uh, Nova Strike. Yeah, that, that'll be nice. See, obviously Karen, uh, he's, he's not, his sprite isn't done. This is what I was talking about. Yes, my lord. I met Apollo, Grandmother, Uncle Poseidon. I've known Artemis and Hermes for so long. I'm impressed they kept my secret from the others all this time. Yeah. But yeah, like, like Supergiant. I don't know. I it, do this. I would say... Greetings, witch. You surpassed me before, yet I wonder. Was it your mastery over our craft? Or did the fates themselves perhaps provide a little nudge? Yeah, I, I would say that money is the death of creativity in a lot of ways. Like when you attach the pressures or maybe maybe it's a pressure in general. And um, yeah, the pressure of, of finances is the death of creativity. I think that that is a big part of it. But like pressure is not necessarily a bad thing. You know, the time constraints can make you get very creative for different reasons, not like art creative necessarily. It's it's a complicated thing, but yeah, I, I really appreciate that Supergiant is remaining to be a independent studio and it's just putting out banger after banger. Just keep doing that. Just keep doing that. Do not do not stop. They they have found how to put magic in a bottle. And hopefully the the amazing talented people at that studio continue to feel inspired to be at that studio and just continue to pump out art piece after art piece. Come, headmistress. If I could be provoked that easily, I'd stand no chance at all. Not even if the fates desired otherwise. Good fortune seldom comes to those in no position to receive it. Show me your victory was no mere accident. So I don't think I'm going to succeed on this one because I've kind of not gotten any mana, right? Like I, I don't have any ability that is restoring mana for me. Uh, which one is the real one? I forgot. Is it that one? No, it's, it's, oh yeah, that's right. Okay, so it is that color. I've already forgotten, you know? <laughs> Oh my goodness, broke my armor. How dare you kill my dress. Oh, the, the fact that my casting speed is like, or channeling speed is like so slow now, I don't like that. It's this one. No, nope, it's this one. No, nope, that was right, okay. So it's, it is the lighter color one. I keep like messing it up. I keep thinking it's the hyper green one, but that is not the case. Just keep running. Oh, you know what? Here we go. Now we have a now we have a reason to dash. Oh wow, that little like pulling is really nice, but I'm not using it. Alright, here we go. Put that down. Maybe I just keep uh, which one is it? This this one? I believe it's this one. Maybe I just keep using my cast, or my sorry, my special from a distance. Rather than... Yeah, that feels pretty good. <laughs> Rather than doing the channel. I think the channel is pretty good, obviously, but... Uh, this one. Oh, no. Jump over it. Don't get hit. Get this down. I'm almost dead. This one. Yeah, I don't know if my attack is more powerful or not. And maybe I should be focusing on that instead. It's, it's hard to tell. Let's just avoid those. I should probably use all of my mana, you know? Oh my goodness. Forgot about this thing. Oh crap. No. 
I want to be polymorph. Yeah. Yeah. Crap. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Can we? There we go. Let's let's take these guys out. <laughs> I love the polymorph. I feel like I could be a little bit better at that though. It's the second time I've been polymorphed doing this fight. I gotta learn the uh, pattern on it. Totally out of mana. Launch this out. Oh, they come back. Ooh, that's good to know. I'm glad I didn't jump in there and start blast, because that's what I was gonna do. It's definitely this one. Jump. Run away. I just don't have enough damage, honestly. It's a, it's a problem. Goodness, that was close, huh? Oh, I could have sworn that was a real one. Remember, these come back, so don't go running into it. Jump, run. Man, I love the like the music on this. It only just now dawned on me how epic it is. Let's not get hit by that, please. Remember, they go back in. The, the effects that they've done for all of the abilities look so good. Oh, let's not get hit by the donuts. Um, jump in there and pop this in. Ah, oh, that didn't do anything because you jumped out of it. That's a hard one. I think the cast is really good. Especially the one that we had in the previous run. But I need to find an opportunity to be using it on this boss fight that's not super bad, like <laughs> like I've been running into. I'm sure it would also help to have the ability to regenerate mana. I'm not currently doing that. Oh my goodness. I almost just died there. That was really close. That in. That attacked us. Oh no! <laughs> Be stronger than this, Millenway. I got too greedy. I almost had her dead. How long has it been? That's how it happens sometimes, though, you know? Some time ago. Ooh, this is very bastion y to me. Two? One. It is the dead of night within a haunted, barely moonlit thicket at the underworld's edge. There, a young forsaken princess. Hunts her prey. I suppose this kind of thing happened in Hades as well. Ready or not, hence I go. Oh, I'm supposed to move. Okay. Hypnos, of course he's asleep. I you farewell for now, Lord Hypnos. I like my dress. It's pretty stylish, to be honest. Where could she be? Is this? The keen-eyed princess finds a set of tracks. Suggesting that her foe trod through this dusty ground not very long before. Shush, Homer. How shall I ever catch her if you're going to describe my every move? I like that we now know for sure that the the narrator is Homer. Uh, I, I, I I have no idea to whom you refer, to whom the Princess of the Dead refers, as she continues on her fateful search. I love this. Quit teasing me and help me look. <laughs> okay, where am I going? Who? You'll find her yet. Odysseus, have you seen Hecate about? You know, her as a child is just adorable. Not in a little while, little goddess. Though I'd expect that pointy hat of hers to give her away. I'll look for it. Thank you. So who's well, got to be around here somewhere, little goddess? Who did Zagreus? No, it's not Sagrius, right? Because she kept saying brother, or the, everybody keeps saying brother. So it's that. Oh, I think I figured it out. Right, right, right. Okay, it's taking me too long on this one. It's that Hades and, um, crap, what's her name? Had another child. So Zagreus has a sister. Got you, Hecate. You're dead. That's what it is, right? Got me, you did, Millenary. But I dare say I can escape your clutches yet. Are you gonna go away again? Hey. Cheater, I can't teleport. Why do you get to teleport? Hi, Shades. Is Hecate about? Huh, not seen her, huh? Can't really see. Should I go that way? Maybe not? 
I heard her howl to the left, but it, it probably means that she just went this way, right? Yeah, there she is. Over there. <laughs> there you are. Got you again. Ah, so persistent. Give up already, witch. For I'm a titaness. You cannot vanquish me. <laughs> I can and shall. All right, how many times do I have to find her? I, I like that it gives you the audio cue of where she might be. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Hecate? What's the matter? Oh, it's merely that I've not heard your laughter before. It reminded me of your mother. A much preferable sound to that of grief. I promise not to cry again. I still get sad sometimes, but not as much. Do not make promises you cannot keep. When tears well up, let them spill forth. They're not so precious that they need be contained. But you never cry, Hecate. And I wish to become strong like you. So that I might find Kronos and destroy him for what he's done. And then you could hear my mother's laugh again. And I shall do everything in my power to prepare you. So that you may succeed where I failed. If not for your family's sake, then for your birthright, as the princess of the underworld. So my assumption is that Kronos has like friz frozen them in time, and like our our whole point of this game is to unfreeze them. What do you mean you failed? You tried to beat Kronos yourself. He hurt you. Concern yourself with your own pain, not mine. Destroying Kronos shall not change the past, and the pain shall linger, though assert itself less frequently with age. But enough of this. On the morrow, we shall teach you to hunt greater prey. Yeah. <gasps> Truly? Oh, death to Kronos. I love this. Oh, gotta talk to my frog. All my life I've prepared, and I'm nowhere near ready, am I? <laughs> Love my frog. Got a brood. This memory of all you lost, it stokes your want for vengeance even now. Yeah, I'm assuming that is the case, right? Because that is Zagreus, Hades, and his mother, and then now her, so. Can I salute? Salutations. Who summons me? Ever think maybe we're just not cut out for this, Mel? Me with the haunting, you with the... What are you trying to do again? Find the Titan of Time. Punish him for his crimes against my family. Restore the rightful ruler of the Underworld. Hey, you're cut out for haunting, Dora. So, I am currently looking up the voice actress. Because I feel like... I've heard her voice before. And sure enough, I'm pretty sure I have because she's in a bunch of stuff. But, um, like, there is no one game um, outside of Diablo 4 that is popping up as, like, the, oh, yeah, that's that's who it is. So she is uh, Narelle in Diablo 4. Now, if you've played Diablo 4, you know who I'm talking about. Um, and it's like, oh, right, gotcha. Yep, that's, that's who it is. That's great that they got her for for this role because I feel like she did a great job in Diablo 4 and she did a great job or she's doing a great job here so hats off to her she's also in a bunch of other stuff like uh Swotor Lost Ark um Genshin Impact like like she's she's voice acted a lot of characters she's in Fallout 76 <laughs> bitch some of you don't even remember that Fallout 76 has voice acting because you haven't played it since launch um Grounded oh man she's in she's in all sorts of stuff anyways good job oh thanks just like I'm sure you're cut out for all that other stuff. I'm actually really excited for Diablo 4. Uh, the fourth uh, fourth season launches tomorrow. Where are you, headmistress? Really looking forward to jumping in and playing. I've had these in my head for long enough. Okay, so I have a couple other options here that I didn't have before, I don't think. So, uh, reagent sensing. After encounters become alerted to any valuable resources in the area. Holy crap, that is nice because I do not check these areas. Flourishing soul, 
Create two soil plots for growing nightshade and other plants. Grants plus one nightshade seeds. Interesting. Um, kinship fortune. You know that this like um, growing thing. Was it? Was it Bastion that kind of had some of this stuff going on? I don't remember. Um, kinship fortune. Update the wretched broker inventory with exotic goods suitable for gifting grants plus one nectar. Wasn't Ambrosia before? Is that no longer the case? Or no, did they change it to Nectar? I think I think, I think it was Ambrosia. Right. And then, uh, yeah, let's get Faded Intervention. Well, actually, I mean, this is Beseech the Three Fates to lend their aid in a time of great need. <sighs> but I kind of want Reagent Sensing, so we're going to do that first. Let's begin. Hear me, Selene, if you so desire. Aid me in finding that which I require. So mote it be. So mote it be. Whoops. I need to dash through. Um, I have nine silver. I believe I need like five for those weapons. Let's do faded intervention. This should help. Oh, daughters of night who can see all tomorrows. Please help me avenge both our family's sorrows. Nothing. I... They didn't listen. Huh. I really like this magic thing that we got going on. Should I do the flourishing soil? I should. I have the Great I have the region. Life. Please listen to my thoughts. It is done. Yeah. Such sorcery. Such sorcery. I can grow things. Nightshade seeds. Must be magic. All right, let's Greetings. chat with him. We've multiple reports the armies of Kronos are massing on the surface up there, and not yet caught wind of your efforts. At least you aren't contending with them, hi? Eh? Hey. My route through the underworld is fraught in its own right, but yes, it's comforting to know that army of traitors remains ignorant of me. There's not a downward route that's more discreet. Those thorny chaps in the woods, they've no love for Kronos either, at least. Hmm. I'll get past them. All right, let's plant uh, nightshade. You'll flourish here. Can I plant this other Plenty one? Room to grow. No. He's just gonna keep sleeping. That's fine. There's really no issue with that. I'm I'm totally okay with that. You two, please keep an eye on things while I'm away. <laughs> All clear. Hello They're there. They're not going to help you, you know. The fates, I mean. They don't take pity on whoever asks. If anything, you'll make things even worse. Maybe you just don't give your sisters enough credit. If they once aided my brother, then there has to be a chance they'll aid us. They have a stake in this too. What, you mean their family? They couldn't care less. Too busy messing with everybody's lives, making it look like an accident. Hmm. You mustn't speak of them that way. Yeah, there's a, there's a lot to unpack with that, isn't there? Death to Kronos. Death to Kronos. All right, what's he got? Um, do I want to do any swap in here? I don't think I do. I'm pretty happy with... With my current set anyway. of resources, I think. Just because I don't know what to do with it. I do want to unlock... Um, oh, there was something there. Can I go back? What was that? Oh, no, it's the time thing on that. Gotcha. It looked like I could, like, buy something. Ashes of the past. Right. So, ashes. I have three remaining. Um, I could go one and two. I mean, the Titan seems pretty good. Gain 20 health and 20 magic. Like, yes, please. That's it's really good. Time. Uh, how much, um, where does it say? I have eight remaining. Okay, so I can't get this one. Let's restore two mana every one second. Or set forth each night with one death defiance. Huh. That's pretty good, actually. Um, I think I should just get this one for now, right? Just unlock Don't it. Don't have enough for that. Oh, it takes ten. Jeez, okay, that's fine. Well, I guess we're going out with what we got. Know. Or it's going to tell me I can... Is it telling me I can unlock things? No. Okay. Good to know. Can I unlock a weapon? The arms of night. Yes, I can. Sister's blades. Uh, slash with furious attacks or strike from afar with a flurry of specials. This sounds like right up my alley. Join with me. Lim and Oros. Sister blades. We're fellow sisters now. Yeah. Before, before I go play with that. Um, what's this other thing? Tablet of peace? 
compel certain loan shades to the crossroads to gain large sums of psyche. Ooh. We have to pick. Well, let's go ahead and get this because I got the resources for it. You are mine now. A trusty tool indeed. Ooh, a trusty tool. She's here now. Watch and learn. Ooh, that feels nice. All right, what's the charge up on it? Oh, it like locks in. That's very interesting. Is that like a? Oh, it's like a charge. Okay, okay, okay. All right, what's the special? The special is just like throw your daggers. Yep. But the charge up on it is. Oh, that's cool. I like that. And then the cast. It's the same. I like this a lot. Hold B to ensnare and destroy. Oh, I don't have any mana. We always get back up. Very interesting. Cool. All right, I'm I'm excited to try these out. I think that these are super cool weapons. Uh, what's the What's the other ones that I could get? I need 15 silver or three silver and three cinders. I think I only have one cinder, so that's not happening this time, which is totally fine. But I am having a lot of fun with our current build. I, I think. I don't know. I, th I think we'll try this out and see if it goes any better than the previous weapon.